I had completed my BA actually, and then I I I would like to have some job. I was trying in uh, for a long time for getting a job. I was not able to get, but a friend of mine told me, "It is uh, uh, you go to Bombay. I will give an address in Bombay. You see him." And uh, he is having a medical stores, Bandra Medical Stores. It is called Bandra Medical Stores, and uh, you can work there, and they will help you. Uh, you can at least have a living. So my job started with the Bandra Medical Stores in Bombay. Then Doctor Chari, who was the uh, who came here. Uh, he was the doctor in in charge of the our general hospital in puttaparthi so when chari came because i used to go to chari's house chari knows me personally it happened that i came to puttaparthi through because i came chari told me that you come and see and all that is my first visit to puttaparthi because of the doctor chari that was about 31 years back so i i was so happy about it and then i continued uh, to come very then my wife used to sing bhajans and all, all that. so when i came here first uh, how, why what thought i had was i was working in medical field and just now they had opened the uh, super speciality hospital here so i thought uh, there may be some need for me Here, so because I am working and I am in the medical field, so I can work in their medical stores, talking and all those things. So I came here, I wrote it uh, in a piece of paper. So I sat there with the letter to give to Swami. Swami came walking, and then Swami looked. Uh, I took took a letter from the left side. Took a letter from the right side. He just looked at my letter and went away. We did not take it. So what to do? I was so much worried about that. And then after the system is that Swami during the darshan, you know, they call people for uh, interview, and after interview and all over, some people for interview. And after interview, Swami come and sit there for bhajan. And after bhajan, Swami goes to back to residence. I mean, this is the system. Uh, what you are there. So when Swami calls people inside and go, what will happen? All the people will go for taking breakfast and coming back for bhajan. I did not go anywhere. I had no feeling. Because of that, you know. So what should I do now? I do not know. So I was so worried. I did not go anywhere. I just sat down there. That's all. And then Swami came after the interview was over to sit in the chair because Bajan is uh, was was going on. When before sitting, he stood a little, uh, one second, near the chair. And then started coming down slowly, 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 slowly. When he is coming down, people all start, people started giving letters. He was not even looking at the letter; he was just walking. So nobody knows for what purpose Swami has coming and all. Then uh, because he is accepting no letter, means I took I put my letter in my lap and then I was also sitting here like that. Swami straight came. And showed the hand to take the letter, and everybody was surprised. And after that, he did not move at all. He just straight straight went to uh, mandir. My my, he came specially for taking my letter. And then uh, I did not know what to do. I told Narayan uh, what uh, what has happened to Narayan. Narayan was the secretary, so Narayan I told that the sir, sir, they are dead. They have taken the letter. I don't know what this is going to do. 
Narayan called me and told next day, Swami wants you to meet uh, Jogarao. Swami told me to go to Jogarao. <laughs> I thought uh, Jogarao is going to tell me, go away from here. So that's what my thought was. So I went to Jogarao and uh, told Jogarao, my name is Unni, sir. Oh, Mr. Unni, very, very happy to see you. Sit down, sit down, sit down. <laughs> he said, he said, oh, okay. Then uh, he, uh, so I was very happy about that. And then Swami said, you, Swami wants you to take over the accommodation in Bhuttaparthi, accommodation of entire accommodation you take and you, it, you will be the in charge. That is the Swami's order. That is how I became the accommodation, still continuing <laughs> so many years, uh, 32 years going on. That is, the, that is how I was here. And here, so many experiences are there with me uh, to Swami, Swami's uh, thing. Uh, so telling some very important uh, things, you know. Swami, my uh, wife, uh, Swami knows, uh, Swami likes her because uh, she sings very well. And then every day, every, every year, November 19th, Ladies' Day, November 19th. So Swami used to give sari to ladies, you know. Even, I think even now it is also continuing. Ladies, sorry. And then afterwards, t call my wife and tell, you give to everybody. That is how it will be. So many years it was going on. One year, Swami uh, came and uh, she did not even, he did not even look at uh, my wife. He came and called some lady Saivadal and said, distribute this sari, this uh, sari. So everybody looked at my wife. <laughs> what is this? Every time Swami used to tell her to, what to do? My, my, she was a little upset, but then he just sat down what to do because, and not only that, Swami did not give sari to her. Everybody, every all ladies got saris, but she did not get sari. Now she cried and all those things, you know, what you can do? So that that happened. While this was well, Swami coming, while going, Swami in the car, Swami asked Padmanabhan to stop the car in front of my wife. And then uh, they, Patnavan opened the door and Swami put the leg and then showed her to take uh, Padamaskar. So she took the Namaskar above. So many people wondered her birthday. You know, so when I went at 8 o'clock uh, from the office to my house, lot of sweet boxes and all those things. Then I asked my wife, what happened? What is this? Swami asked me to take the uh, namaskar and I took that. People thought it is my birthday. So they have brought uh, this. Uh, so many ladies had brought this. Then uh, I, my daughter in Hyderabad was talking to me and uh, I, I was talking to her. Uh, then afterwards, uh, she went to the bathroom. And then it was a Tuesday, Hanuman Charisa, you know, normally Hanuman Charisa, Tuesday. So I was telling, I was starting Hanuman Charisa. My wife came and then uh, went inside. I heard suddenly a sound. She had fallen down. 
and immediately i went and uh, got her into my lap and she passed away she was uh, she she was had a ma- massive heart attack that's what has happened now what to do you can cry and all those things you can do but what can do so anyway uh, patnaben i told patnaben uh, came and uh, to uh, brought the ambulance and then and body was kept it in the uh, general hospital and then uh, to inform no so i went uh, morning uh, to mandir swami's residence and then told them that uh, um, i want to inform swami about my wife passed away and so i can just to inform that's all yeah when swami comes down we will tell you this is the no problem swami comes down i will be tell you will wonder you know how swami came down swami came down with a sari swami came down with a sari gave the sari give to unni house swami knew that uh, that that sari is required only for last journey so we put that sari only to uh, that is the that is the way it is and swami every everything you know what is happening uh, swami swami knew about that my daughter was in hyderabad and then uh, i just want to see her i went by flight uh, bangalore to hyderabad i went by flight there was water i fell down i fell down and then uh, what to do nothing can be done so they treated me and they, they my daughter took me the uh, airport itself will took care of me and then to the hospital but i had a fracture in the back so they said you can't you, you we can do everything but you will be always in wheelchair and uh, nothing else can be done so i was coming uh, in wheelchair for darshan also wheelchair there is nothing else you, i can't walk i go to office in wheelchair i used to go for darshan for wheelchair so when once i was waiting uh, i mean i was sitting for uh, swami's darshan swami was coming at that time in wheelchair so i had a thought swami crores of people are coming to see you you are coming as in a wheelchair doesn't look nice people want you to walk if it is a karma the part of a karma swami i would like to be anyway i am i am in the wheelchair i will take that also you are that karma aspect kindly give to me so that i can be in the wheelchair and then you start walking huh that is that's what my thinking so strong it was swami came swami was coming in the wheelchair and then swami just looked at me and went to the uh, stage you know what he did he created vibhuti before sitting created vibhuti and asked us on you to unni that okay so that vibhuti brought it and gave to me you believe it or not second day onwards i started walking up to this time afterwards no wheelchair nothing see what what you can say about it 
that is what uh, swami is and there are so many instances which we do not know one lady came to me and told uh, i used to give that yellow slip you know for sitting in the um, preference in the front so um, uh, she said i want a, one young lady usa lady uh, i want a chit uh, to sit so while writing that uh, slip yellow slip mrs shauri i write you know so the name and the one lady and all i asked her a question you you want uh, you your birthday or your marriage anniversary just i asked you know when i was writing no 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 i am from usa very beautiful lady i am from young lady i am from usa i am suffering from cancer and the usa cancer institute told uh, we can't do anything it is beyond treatment so anyway i have to die in cancer only but before that i want to give a letter to swami that's all that is way and darshan and that is how i have come and tomorrow itself i am going back to usa okay i said okay no problem so i gave that and she was sleeping um, sitting with the letter and then uh, swami looked at the letter and went away swami did not take it so this lady came back and said swami did not take my letter what to do i told her see whatever happens it will happen swami before you start writing the letter swami as far as we are concerned swami knows what you are going to write you think that uh, he has to all the letters people are giving you think that he will open that and see what it is he knows what it is what is in, inside he need not even open that he need not even open that is our swami we know he knew what it is okay whatever it may be and then i uh, gave vibhuti prandya vibhuti and said whatever happens happen you take vibhuti put it in the water and a little glass put it in in front of uh, swami's photo and take it three times a day every day that's all whatever happen let it happen okay i will go like that but what to do swami swami's wish she went away after three months one lady came to me and said sir do you know me i see so many <laughs> Uh, foreigners so i said uh, i have seen you but i don't remember where i have seen you do you remember a lady came to you swami did not take the letter for cancer and swami did not take the letter and then you gave a budi to that lady that you know yes sir yes, i know that i know i remember that i am that lady then i asked what happened no as you said i took that and keeping that vibhuti to in front of swami's photo i was taking it after three months i felt uh, uh, very well and then i went to the same cancer institute where they were they had said that uh, it is beyond treatment they tested there was no cancer at all so this is this is what it is and that's what swami had done i said swami bless you that's all what i can say what else what else it is another time one uh, young boy was, uh, mother is bringing in a wheelchair and said uh, bond is it the wheelchair should go inside first gate and then give me a chit so i right and asked as uh, what happened no what happened i asked her. what happened was uh, he was uh, playing and then uh, he fell down and fractured 
and the fracture is uh, so serious that uh, everything is okay now, but he cannot stand up and uh, do it. So he is in the wheelchair. That's all. So just want to have a darshan of Swami, nothing else. So uh, for him uh, also, Swami, the, the, the uh, Bibhuti we was given, had Swami in darshan and went away. After a few days, a few months, that boy comes back by walking. Wow. He, he came by walking and said, Sir, Swami made me walk. I just want to tell you. That's why I just came for that. So this is our Swami. There are so many instances where you, things, you know, which is beyond our imagination. Swami knew it and Swami does whatever uh, is to be done. This is what it is. So uh, that, the, that is the way Swami had uh, dealt. Now what I am going to tell now is a subject which actually the general public should know. Because in many satsangas, I used to ask one question. Uh, this, is, this is a subject which I want to radio side to because it is a very important subject. I used to ask in public meeting, I mean, wherever I am going satsanga, I used to ask, the watch which you are wearing, you are selected. The shirt or blouse or whatever it may be, you selected. Sari you selected. Everything you select now. Who selected your mother? Then uh, they say, Mother selected God. God. What God? God has nothing to do with all these things. So many people are, uh, so many animals are killed. So many people are killed. God comes and tells, no, 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 you don't do that. Nothing. It's an observation only. He, he sees what it is. For all your actions, what is happening is what you should know. That is, your mother is selected by your karma. Action, reaction is the basic principle of the creation. Then I used to ask uh, in public meeting, when I, whenever I, I am attending, what was there before creation, for how the creation has started? How the creation started? From where? What was there before? Before God. Before that, it God. Creation started. How the creation started? God in what form? So there only what is more important is there is only one thing existing. This is what everybody should know. There is only one thing existing, consciousness and nothing else. And that consciousness in an, in an elephant, the consciousness in an ant are the same. So it the, the the see the prana is there, body is there. Prana prana uh, brings see the what is the selection? You have prana, intellection, intellect, mind. These are the things. So actually, the creation is like that in such a way that prana is there, body is there. The prana goes, body goes, goes. It be it is only being uh, burned. Body has nothing, wow, this is a flesh. But there inside what, what you are acting, thinking, and everything you are doing, the creation is like that. That I am telling about the creation. The creation is what? It's only consciousness. And in all the sages which are, say, which are sitting in the, the consciousness, you are consciousness. Swami, Swami himself told, I am God. I know it. You are God. You don't know that. That's all the difference. Nothing else. 
only existing today is consciousness. Everything works with the consciousness. The consciousness is the energy. The consciousness is the energy which makes people work. That, that is the energy. That energy, how to use the mind and the indirection. You, you lift the hand, mind wants to lift the hand. And then the eating, the, that is good or bad, the indirection. So you have that system. Indirection is the indirect, you are you having indirect, uh, in, you ask the intelligence in you, I mean you find out, no, no, you should not be taken like that. But what is happening is that, what has happened in the world is, the mind will never consult intellection. Intellect. Mind, mind is the thing which is overruling the intellect also. And mind does, my st mind starts what it likes. And then what happens? That is the karma. That karma goes on. And what happens? You have killed an animal, you become an animal next. And the animal becomes a GV uh, and then kill you. Maybe tiger becoming ca camel, camel becoming tiger for the exchange of that things and all. So this will go on. Definitely, this is the process, that's all. It's going on like that. The life is going on like that. But then what is most important, which uh, people do not know, the birth as a human being is giving, given by God an opportunity to merge in Him. Nobody knows it. 98% of the people do not know that. 98% of the people do not know the importance of human birth. You are given an opportunity by God to see that you are merging in him back. What happened? Then what is to be done is that the mind should have that sort of a character, love all, serve all, help our hurt never. If this is being our Balevikas, for example, our Balevikas, that Balevikas if it is from the very beginning, the Balayugas is uh, learning that there is a lot of difference in the children, people, because they have learned that love all, serve all, help our to all. Some people may not change that, but that is the that is the most important thing to know. As a human being, you will take this opportunity to merge in Swami. For that, what will help? Your karma, your action. Your action only will help. You have, you are acting in such a way that in life, that, that, and then very, very important, Simon, I asked to ask the question in a public meeting. Sages, there are sages in Himalaya. And Swami himself told once, I don't know, you, other, you, you will also be knowing that. The sage always thinks about uh, God only, no? So where, when he dies, what happens? He will merge with uh, God. That is all. Because so many years, years. And the last minute of his birth, a sage, oh, I am going, what will happen to the cat? One cat used to sleep with him. So his thinking is that, oh, what will happen to that cat? That's all, finished. He became, he, he comes back to earth cat. Again, that uh, circle goes on. He has to come as a cat. That is why the most important thing that you should not have any attachment. That is not Dhamma, Jividam and all those things, you know, life and all those things will be there. 
there should be only one thing in the mind god and that is why swami very clearly told chindane salu nama me melu swami has told that chindane salu that mean nama me melu means we, we have many people om sai ram 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 108 times every day he is writing sai ram sai ram sai ram oh i will teach that lesson that prolo did not give me money back or sai ram sai ram what is the value for that so you should have no attachment to anything even dying you know one parent dying maybe very good person very nice person loving uh, god everything is there but last breath thinking oh my daughter is not married i am going that's all no such a thought should be there there be only one thing that thought should be only bhagavan god swami you always think that chindane ada that is why swami very clearly told chindane salu nama me melu only you think about god and nothing else and you will merge in god up to the last minute no attachment with anything because your attachment means you will be thinking about that attachment only when you are going so this is the thing only chinda swami